All right, welcome back, everybody. Brett wanted me to say welcome back. Shout out, class, because he got a cool shot. Yeah. Here it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. It's like spirit or some shit. Yeah, man. It's so bad. Wait, spirit? Yeah. You're talking about Stallion of the Cimarron? No, it's called Spirit. Yeah, the movie, right? The animated movie with yeah, the horse? Yeah, Spirit. Yeah, it was called Spirit Stallion of the Cimarron. Well, then I'm just going to say Matt, Spirit because I don't remember the other part. <laughs> Matt Damon played the voice of the Matt horse. Damon. <laughs> Matt Damon. Matt Damon. Matt <laughs> Damon. Let's ask a question for the start of this episode. Oh, my God. Right into it. Yes. He was all like, blah, 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 blah. Can you stop giving me shit when I ask you to read No, a we just got a question from, someone shut up. Thinks that, shh, no, shh, shh, hold calm, on. Calm we yourself. got an angry comment I've from got, someone. Hold on. I've got one from Hi, Hello, Good Day, who is in the Twitch stream, who just Fine. sent a message. So I'm going to read that one. Apparently, what you have to say is more important uh, than what I have to say. Yeah, it's Hi, Hello, Good Day. This, this is much more important. That is more important. <laughs> Where do you guys see your channel going in 2018? Oh. Interesting. Do you have an answer to that? Uh, hmm, hmm. Well, I, I I just got my tablet set up again. Uh, I'm going to probably try and do some animations. Yeah. It's going to be some fun. Yeah. Um, uh, we, we've got some plans. Brett's been working a little bit on, on getting all the clips and stuff together. We're going to mm -hmm. be... Uh, Shooting those out, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna try to complete more series because in 2017 we kind of jumped around a lot. Yeah, 2017 we started a lot of new series, but we didn't really complete much. So in 2018 we're definitely gonna we're gonna be uh, closing out some series. Yes. Um. So yeah, there's gonna be more. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna probably test a few different things because yeah. we obviously have a format. More collabs. Uh, gonna try to collaborate with people. With pineapple. Um. Mm. Of mm. course, mm. Uh, we have a uh, we have an OCD when it comes to like quality and stuff. So right. So it's uh, we're gonna we're gonna make sure that we. Yeah. That as we, we as keep, we keep the quality. As dickish as it sounds, um, we have a much higher quality on our content than most people at our sub range do and um we want to keep that quality through all of our videos yeah but it's hard to get people to collaborate with you unless they're around the same sub range at you as you yeah so <laughs> it's catch me too yeah we're gonna we're gonna try to work it out um, yeah we're, we're keeping our eyes open for channels and hey if you guys see any channels that you like that are around our same sub range uh, let us know, cause um, cause we're always looking for people to collab with. Yeah, if you like us and you like them, then you know, we'll do a little babies making. Hey yo, maybe uh, you could be the start of something magical, <laughs> and the end of something magical too. If you know <laughs> what I'm talking <laughs> about. What are you talking about? I have no idea. All right. Uh, so yeah, that's where we're going. We're gonna we're gonna try to to amp up a little bit of extra stuff and uh, just keep tuning the knobs. Yeah. And uh, and you know, doing more. Uh, like fine tuning the community stuff that we're doing. Yep. Uh, probably more bot tools for Discord and all that kind of stuff. Yep. And slowly counting down the days till I can quit my job. <laughs> That's the one most of these days, part. Brent. One of these. One of these days. Fucking days. I just did like a full circle around this mountain. Why did you do that? I don't know. You you want me to read questions so you can get to where you're going? You're going in circles. What the fuck? All right. Question number two. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Thanks. Hi. Hello. Good day, by the way. Yeah. Thank you for the question. Uh, Bobby Moher. Moher? More? More. M O H R. Yeah. yeah more. more. All right. Cool. Uh, what? Oh, what's a game genre you guys are not particularly into? Oh. Uh, I was starting to answer this inside of the comment. I was like, wait a second. This is a question. Aha. Uh -huh. Um, this actually happened, I think, within it was like 16 hours ago. Yeah. I was at 322. So it's recent. Pretty recently. It's within yeah. the last day. Yeah. Um, so, uh, w between both of us, uh, we like pretty much every genre, but the yes. one that we hate is uh, uh, visual novels. Yes. We don't, we don't really play those on our own or yeah. on the channel or anywhere. Yeah. So, yes. That's probably the only one I know that I'm not into. Yeah. I Brett has probably a longer list, but I, I like a ton of, ton of different yeah, genres. And I think also neither of us are particularly fond of sports games. But that's just because uh, I don't know. NFL Blitz is pretty amazing. NFL Blitz doesn't count. I fucking love NFL Blitz uh, too. But that uh, game is... NBA Jam. <laughs> oh, dude, I never played that one. That one's good. That one's kind of like NFL Blitz. What are you doing? I'm looking for one of those lizards. Oh, there's uh, usually one on every one of these shrines, but I might have already gotten this one. And I actually got pretty good at one of the non-Blitz NFL games. Uh, uh, it's pro it's not one that I play often. Sports games. Yeah. Uh, but I do play them. All right, fair enough. I like this the, when you got the strategy. Oh, there he is. He's on the floor right there. Because in the like those NFL games, you kind of strategize and like learn what the other team does and how they play, and it's kind of more interesting. Sure. What the fuck? Where'd he go? 
Do you ah, like? Ah, good Jim. Do you like strategy Fuck sims? You. Uh, yeah, no, that's gonna be uh, the the genres that I don't like are strategy games, simulator games, um, like any like Sim City, uh, Total War, Civilization. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's all. I don't I don't dislike the idea of it. I just don't like them in execution. I think they're boring. Mm. That's all mm. it is. Mm. So like Roller Coaster Tycoon, mm -hmm. I would never play that game of in my course. own time. Yeah. But I had fun playing it with you. Yeah. Just because you were playing and I got to, I got to focus. Got to on experience just, it and just yeah. Focus Point, on the things you liked about it. Yeah, pointing out the stupid shit that I noticed. Yeah. Just, I like Strat Sims and, and uh, like I played a lot of uh, like Age of Empires and uh, uh, Empire Earth. Yeah. Empire Two and some StarCraft. Yeah, I, I love uh, I love the the Strat Sims. I, I love uh, first person shooters. Uh huh. I played a lot of first person shooters. Um, oh, yeah, I, I love first person shooters. MMOs, first, first person shooters. <laughs> yeah. yeah, MMOs. I'm I'm iffy about. There's some that I really liked. I put a shit ton of time into World of Warcraft back in the day. Yeah. Uh, but then the majority of the ones that I play, I'm just kind of like, what's different about this from every other MMO I've ever played? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Um, have you ever played Planet Side or Planet Side Two? It's a first person shooter in my Uh, no. That one's pretty fun not. with friends. I played Sounds a lot cool. of that one. Yeah, I'm. Uh, for me, I pretty much like every genre uh -huh. other than uh, other than this visual novels. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, I think I'm with you, I except for strategy scenes. Except for <laughs> stress. <laughs> except for the ones that I don't agree with. Oh yes, this place. Oh, I fucking love this place, dude. Be. I don't think I was supposed to do that. <laughs> <laughs> he died in midair, everybody. Whoops. Why did you do that? I didn't think that I... Look. Wow, in a game that's really hard to die I in. I didn't mean to do that. Here's I, the I death. I thought that, that there was a thing down there. Are we going all the ba way back to the uh, thing? No, no, no. Went I arrested like, it. Remember there was one right here and I killed this dude in the lawn? Go put your dick on. Oh, yeah. So the entrance should be right over here again. Sweet. So we are going to. This is like a. This is just a pure Q and A episode because we have done nothing and it's been eight minutes. We have done something. Been. Uh, I've killed two crystal lizards. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Jumped off a cliff, and we answered some important questions. Let's do one more question then. I, I have one ready. Okay. Cool. You ready? I'm Don't ready. jump off that cliff. I won't. I know you're tempted. Calm down. I'm you just love your cliffs. I know. Taking the sights right now. So this is from Servbot Spy. This reminds me of Uncharted. A little bit, yeah. Uh, huh. Do you think quick time events in games can be utilized properly in games? Absolutely, I think so. Yeah, I think uh, I think they can be done really poorly. Like when you have quick time events that just like try to trick users. Yeah, because that's like anti quick time. Mm -hmm. If you have like, uh, especially if those ones, those games where they have it in a certain place and they're like, ha ha, tricked you, and then they put like, yeah, like a bad thing there because uh -huh. you're not quick enough or something. Yeah, the. It's, the biggest offender for me move. with quick time events, I, I don't even dislike quick time. Like, I'm totally fine with them. Uh, the biggest offender for me is if it's in the middle of a cutscene, like a, a story scene, because as a gamer, your instinct when you see a cutscene is to put down the controller and, <laughs> and start just taking it so in. So all and, of Heavy Rain. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, that, that's obviously that's one that you know you got to hold on to. It. But like a game like Resident Evil 4... Like I usually would would put down the controller during the cutscenes and and just kind of enjoy what's happening. You do and pay put attention down the controller story. a lot. I, do, I I really do. I like to. Okay, that's too much saturation. Yeah, that's crazy. God. This area is so fucking gorgeous. Oh my god, I love it. Look at that water. This is why we're not getting to the next Colossus Calm in this your episode. Ass. <laughs> um, but wow. if I'm in the middle of a fucking um. Uh, cutscene and I've put down the controller and then you decide to throw out a fucking two second timer on pressing triangle because some dude decides to throw a knife at my face. That is not cool. Yeah. That's just straight up dickatry. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. And then just like over usage of quick time events obviously is a no no. Yeah. Like Resident Evil 6 think, was like that. It was just non-stop quick time events. I think quick time events also have to be introduced early. Because yeah. if you're like mid game and all of a sudden there's quick time you're like what the fuck? Mm -hmm. Is, yeah, it's one of those kind of thing mechanics that you just you got to show them early to let them know it's gonna happen at some point. Yeah, I think that the the best example of quick time events for me is the God of War series. Mm -hmm. Not only are there uh, quick time events um, like in boss fights and stuff, but yeah. they're even in just the standard gameplay. Like a lot of um, like if you're 
fighting the minotaurs once he gets down to a certain level of damage yeah you can press a button on him which will then go into the quick time event where you mash circle in order to slam the blades yeah. of chaos into its mouth and it's yeah. like that's cool you're using the gameplay and it's not forced you you choose to go up and press circle and do that quick time event yeah, you don't have to good. do it it's probably the best the, the best form of it really yeah. mm -hmm. is just to like enhance whatever's going on yeah like you're already pressing stuff just mm -hmm. like enhance it yep Agreed. It's good. All right. Well, we're at the Colossus. Awesome. And on the next episode, we're going to fight the Colossus. <laughs> <laughs> Stop pausing it. Oh, wait. I pause it so that the cutscene cut doesn't oh go. Yeah. God. Calm yourself. I have calmed. Damn, man. <laughs>